what's going on guys, this is Boot Tramp playing Boom Beach, so Dr. Terror is here and I'm gonna be guiding you through how to defeat his base from stage 1 to stage 7 and I'm gonna be using my favorite combo, Scorches and Tanks, let's see what we got here, so basically what you see is like 5 boats of tanks and 3 boats of Scorches and let's not waste time, we're gonna be attacking Terror stage 1 right now, so uh, should I be dropping barrages and artillery shells to take out the HQ? No, I'm gonna be using crit and I'm gonna be having some fun here. I'm gonna be dropping one box there and there and as you see there I'm pretty much swarming the whole thing here. The rocket launcher cannot do anything and the critters takes it down and heading over to the HQ and pretty much head blasting and smacking the HQ and down it goes. Terror stage 1 just went down and I didn't get any prototype module. I'm always in seek of prototype modules because I want to make some awesome prototype defenses. You need a lot of prototype modules to get get those maxed up defenses so let's see what we got here on the third stage two we got a rocket launcher uh, close to the HQ and some machine gun that's not dangerous at all for my critters because my critters are just swarming the whole thing here attacking pretty much machine gun at the HQ down it goes and we got no prototype modules I'm always like what will I get what will I get my eyes is like it's boosting up guys the ice is like whoa if I get a product module so let's see what we get in the, pro the terror stage 3 right now so we got like a shock launcher and that's gonna be really scary actually should I be using critters here so I'm gonna be dropping down the shock launcher with barrage or artillery shell and I'm gonna be dropping down the critters right there upon those well in the middle of the cannon so the so the critters can take down the cannons and the mortars and look at this guys this is totally ham banana I'm blasting down everything that the critter sees right now the, the, the cannons are just going down like a flag guys I'm telling you it's like it's like jingle berries or dangle berries guys so the critters are heading over to the HQ and the HQ is just going down so fast and boom there we go we took that turn stage three and what do we get oh, of course we get a prototype module right there a power rod that is so cool. Uh, the drop chance from the prototype modules is so low, and that is why I'm getting. I, I'm actually going like this. Yes, like that, guys. So uh, we got a prototype module there, and I really hope I can get more. I will be like super happy if I get another prototype module. Let's see what we get on turn stage four. So as you see here, it's actually developing. The base is developing on defensive buildings. It's getting more and more, and more of those, and it's getting harder. I definitely understand it on the lower level gameplay. This is like a hard banana. It's hard. It's oh, that sounded wrong, guys. Hard banana, but I meant like it's hard. <laughs> it's really hard. So, anyways, turn stage four, no problems at all. I just blasted it down with the scorches and tanks. I definitely recommend you guys to use scorches and tanks on Dr. Turk date, uh, Dr. Turk dates because you, you basically don't lose too much troops and that means you save a lot of diamonds if you're using like warriors you're always losing one warrior or you might be losing more I'm telling you guys scorches and tanks is totally B so this is turn stage 5 and it's getting uh, a lot more harder my tanks and my scorches are doing less damage well they're not doing less damage the building's got more HP so it does looks like my scorches and my tanks are doing less damage on defensive buildings So what is the biggest threat here guys? What is the biggest threat? I've been telling you many times boom cannons and cannons make sure you you stick your eyes to the screen and pay attention uh, To those boom cannons because those are dangerous. I'm telling you I'm telling you it's really hard So our uh, turn stage 5 is going down like a butterfly guys. No problem at all My tanks and my scorches are maxed up and by the way, I didn't boost up up my tanks and my scorches for Dr. Terror today because I figured out on uh, several uh, Dr. Terror uh, events ago I, I was thinking like okay why am I boosting up my t my units when I'm attacking Dr. Terror but when I can take down Dr. Terror without using any boost at all so uh, I've been saving a lot of power powders uh, using this method not using any power powders at all taking down Dr. Terror and yes this is of course for people that is maxed up level on the units, you, can, you don't need to boost up any uh, any statues at all. Uh, but if you're lower lower level, you definitely need to boost up your statues. Okay, uh, this is the third stage six, and uh, we're facing like a lot of mortars here, and mortars are dangerous against scorches because scorches can take tons 
of uh, shots from the mortars. The, 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 the uh, Scorch has got tons of HP right here, and my tanks are just doing massive damage, just blasting down all of the defense abilities so I'm distracting those two, two boom cannons right there with my critters I just love the critters because they are distracting everything I mean like they, they, they step in on the boom mine uh, they can distract the rocket launcher, the shock launcher, the boom cannon it's super awesome I'm so glad they invented up the critters because those are very helpful and uh, if you're gonna be using critters uh, make sure you pro whoa we got we got uh we got a proton modules right here guys a filled capacitor this is the second uh this is the second proton module we get right now on this doctor terror event what is going on this is like minimum chance guys what is the chance of getting two proton modules from uh uh the doctor terror event is so awesome so okay terror stage seven I'm totally hyped right now I got like two uh two proton modules and some crystals I'm just gonna be taking out my tanks and my scorches and I'm gonna be letting them have some fun and let's see if we can take down this base I really do want it right now if I can take down this base because it does looks like it's really really hard on the defensive layout we have like tons of cannons and boom cannons to the left side same with the shock launcher and it makes it really really hard for me whoa I got a lot of air guys I've got a lot of air in my belly <laughs> in my belly so okay I'm keeping on shocking the cannon and the boom cannon the rocket launcher right there and I'm dropping down on on scorch already I've lost one scorcher already and I basically haven't touched the HQ yet I need to touch that HQ what is going on so should I be relocating my tanks and my scorches or should I just YOLO down at the uh, the base I don't think I will be able to take out this base right now because I've lost two scorches that is the third scorcher come on come on third scorcher just went down that means I have no walls at all, my tanks are naked, they cannot handle too much damage from the cannon sniper towers and the boom cannons. I would totally be uh, tasting a lot of juice right now, orange juice guys. So, uh, would I be able to touch that, uh, that uh, HQ, I just want to touch that HQ with my tanks, with the artillery shells from the tanks, so, yes I touched it, my goal is complete right now, my goal is complete, I touched the HQ and he's feeling me right now and I'm gonna be losing right now, I I I'm gonna be losing guys, I'm telling you the shock launcher right there is stopping or or it's preventing uh, for my tanks to damage the HQ, that shock launcher, holy banana baby banana I need to retreat this so uh, I'm gonna be going once again I'm not gonna be stopping attacking Dr. Terror stage 7 because it's like guaranteed crystal drop and I'm not gonna be uh, backing off from this base I do think I will be able to blast out this base so let's go ahead and build up another bulk of tanks and scorches I'm gonna be heading over to the base and there we go instead finish the troops and heading back again to Dr. Terror stage 7 like that so uh, let's see what happens right now so dropping out the scorches and the tanks um I'm, th I'm thinking like i'm gonna be gathering up my scorches and my tanks on the right side there because there's a lot of boom cannons and defensive structures on the left side i, I really do not want to face them all I, I really do not want to face them so shocking the cannon and the flamethrowers i have no idea why i shocked those uh, units but it doesn't really matter i'm gonna be crushing down terror stage 7 right now and by the way guys if you do struggle against terror stage Stage seven. Um, do not do not do the same thing over and over again. Uh, if you know it's a total fail, because uh, you need to improvise the the path you're gonna be going. So as you saw here, on the second attempt, I went full to the right here and cleared out uh, cleared out the defensive buildings. Uh, that I only need to clear and oh my dangers that sounded so wrong So anyways, I'm relocating my tanks and my scorchers like this and this looks like it's gonna be a win guys It's gonna be a win. I still got like three scorchers right there And my first scorch just went down did hurt the HQ really bad there because because when the scorches go down they blast they do a blast and do some damage on the buildings that's surrounding them so my tanks is focusing on damaging that HQ right now all of my scorches are gone I'm assisting my tanks with some critter spawn here so I'm tossing boxes of critters assisting the HQ and I'm distracting the shock launcher from the tanks 
to prevent to be preventing to get shot on the tanks. So there we go. Third stage seven just went down, and what the dangers just happened right now? I lost words. I lost words when I was attacked. I was like, whoa, 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 what's going on? It might be the uh, the prototype modules uh, that made me like super hyped, guys. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to leave a like if you did like the video, and comment down below if there's anything you want to ask. I'll be trying to answer those. Goodbye. Boom.